Hello everyone, this is Leftos from the NLSC forums and I'm uh, here to show you another tutorial for uh, Roster Merge, the latest version, version 0.2. If you don't know what Roster Merge is um, or how to use it, I've already put yesterday a tutorial up for version 1, 0.1, so check that one out first because this will be really quick just to showcase a new feature. So, um, what Roster Merge does, as we saw in the previous tutorial, is combine two rosters, get the, post of, uh, get the best of both worlds. So, what we did yesterday was um, try to transfer uh, the edits Albis does in the current players to, uh, to Hawk 23's ultimate base roster V20 to get the best out of the current teams and also Hawks trades and rookies for the t uh, from the 2012 NBA draft. So what we're going to do today is take that one step further and uh, not only are we going to combine um, the ratings from Albies to uh, for the current players to ultimate base roster, but uh, today we're going to get the rookies and trades that Hawk has done in his roster and get them to the Albis roster, uh, at the same time keeping all the ratings for the players that Albis has. So, what we're going to do first, let me disable the my front panel, so what we're going to do first is do the same thing that we did yesterday, we're going to copy the whole players tab from each roster. Let me close everything here. Okay, so here's the players from Albis roster, let me save this. All the files should be in the same folder. Okay, but now w I'm going to switch to the Teams tab, select everything from the Teams as well, copy, create a new document, save everything. Uh, this is important, uh, the name of the file should be the same as the file you just saved with the players, but with an underscore and the word Teams. So I saved Albis51 with the players and Albis51 underscore Teams with the teams. Okay, uh, we're done with Albis, let's go to the ultimate base roster. Let's select everything from here. Copy, create a new document, S paste and save. Also go to the teams tab, select everything, copy, paste and save. So, I know that um, Albis has the ratings I need, has most of the current players uh, and the ultimate base roster has uh, more players, more current players uh, and the rookies, some trades that Albis hasn't gotten around to doing yet so I want to get just that, the Albis roster with the trades and rookies and any other changes to the current teams rosters and situationals that uh, Hawk has done. So I'm going to start roster merge. You should go to the according folder where you've uh, extracted roster merge 0.2.1. Okay, let's fire it up. Here it is. Let's select that we want to begin from the uh, ultimate base roster V20 you select the players file, not the teams file. The tool will automatically detect the teams file. So, okay, so Hawk has also increased the ages of the players and their Gears Pro. So, I want that. It's in the bio section, as we can see. If I switch on my friend panel and go to let that load for a bit. Go to players. I can see that the bio has both the birth year and the years pro. So last year's rookies are two years pros or are in the second year. 
in the ultimate base roster so I want that and I also want the updated contracts so I get the uh, any new contracts that have occurred and Abyss doesn't have so I don't want anything else to be replaced I don't want the appearance of the players to change I don't want um, uh, their capabilities I don't want um, their skills or tendencies to change I like those just like Albis has them um, since uh, since uh, the ultimate base roster however adds portraits replaces the portraits and adds cyber faces let's choose to also transfer any cyber face IDs and portrait IDs over okay so these are the two new options this is a teams mode I want to enable that so that uh, every current teams roster I'm only doing this for current teams right now so it will take less and it's less risky um, I am selecting the teams option so that team rosters and situationals will transfer over to the Alpes roster and also um, uh, I'm selecting the no FA so I don't have to bother with free agents in the Alpes roster I don't care if those get updated or not um, if a player is uh, is a free agent in the Alpes roster but is in uh, some team in the ultimate base roster I should be asked to resolve that conflict as always so let's go and do just that okay so a new feature of 0.2.1 is that if you're using the teams mode you also get the names of the teams instead of just team IDs and uh, having to look them up in the R editor. So, okay, I know that um, in Albi's roster, Andre Guadala is in the 76ers, but uh, the ultimate base roster has two Andre Guadalas, one in the modern, in the current 76ers, and one in the 2005-2006 teams, uh, team of the 76ers. So, I'm uh, going to pick of course the current Andre Guadalla and, and tell the roster merge tool to not bother me if there are if there are players are in the same team okay so here we go here's another conflict Albis has uh, Cory Maggette, Maggette or however he's called in the Bobcats but um, uh, uh, the uh, the ultimate base roster has him correctly traded to the Pistons so I'm going to pick this I don't want an old Corey Maggetti either from the old Clippers or Bobcats Legends or whatever um, Sean Livingston oh. uh, Albis has them in the box but he's in the Rockets so I'm going to recognize the trade as well Jermaine O'Neal Albis had them in the Cel in Celtics. However, um, uh, Jermaine O'Neal um, is not in the uh, NBA team. Uh, Hawk had put him in the in a D League team, so you could use him if you wanted. So I'm going to ask the um, the tool to get his. Uh, bio and contract and um, uh, cyberface from the from the sky for century and if he ends up if he is in a team um, uh, since he isn't in a team this shouldn't bother the Celtics the Celtics will have their uh, roster overeaten and they'll know that Jermaine O'Neal is no longer there after this is done okay and uh, some more trades that I have to confirm be careful not to select um, a classic player to be copied over. Okay, okay. So we're done. Okay, let's check out everything. My the Notepad Plus Plus tool knows that uh, Albis 5.1 and Albis 5.1 teams. These two files have changed because the tool edited them, of course. So let me select everything. Go to our editor, save the Albis roster under a different name. Let's say Albis 5 1 draft. Okay, so let me go to the top of the 
the, the top left cell of the teams teams tab let me select everything from the teams file paste okay should be done uh, let me check everything out here we go as you can see right now um, there are some players in the 76ers that um, are not there yet and that's um, that's to be expected because we haven't copied the new players and the edited players yet so I'm going to go here copy everything from here go to the players tab paste everything here I'm going to wait until my CPU calms down okay should be done let's go back to the teams and check out if the 76ers still have missing players nope Harkless is there, Moultrie is there everybody is here and they have 15 players if I go to the Pistons I should see that they have 17 players um, they shouldn't be missing those 900 and 901 um, let me just pause and uh, come back to you yeah so apparently this was a bug um, uh, uh, our editor just hasn't detected the players yet see when I click on this it uh, actually finds the player he was copied over correctly okay also this should be here as well Chris Middleton and I'm guessing Kim English is okay so you don't have to do that um, the IDs are already there um, uh, if you don't have the my friend panel you won't even notice the difference everything should be ready to go so you see I have the Albis 5.1 uh, draft roster which is uh, the Albis 5.1 roster with all the players and the ratings and the play styles and the playbooks and everything and I've just uh, got the latest roster and situationals that uh, Hawk has put in his ultimate base roster so my uh, so all the current teams in Albis have the players with Albis ratings and just um, the uh, have copied also have the draftees and any trades so this should help you if you're too impatient to wait for your favorite roster maker to update the roster or if you just want to combine your favorite rosters and get the best out of both worlds um, you can use this feature and uh, let me as always hear your suggestions and uh, questions and any problems you have in the NLC forums in the roster merge thread in the NBA 2K12 releases and previous subform so this is all from me I hope I've helped you enough and I hope that you'll enjoy uh, combining rosters and getting your favorite ones out of this tool so a last note a little bit of, the, of a disclaimer just because you can combine those rosters and get something really great out of it doesn't mean doesn't mean you should release them never release a roster with edits of your own or a combined roster or whatever without prior permission from the people who made them so even though I created the uh, combined roster of Albis and Hawk 23's work I'm not allowed to release them anywhere unless I get permission from both Albis and Hawk 23 keep that in mind and have fun